Hey everyone, it's Player 31 here. Welcome back to more Pokemon Coliseum. Last episode, we finished round four of Deep Coliseum and got some intel that the Deep King was going to be entering in the next round and we ought to go and fight him because he, he evidently has a Shadow Shuckle. Um, we did get Team 2 as well, which is Dragon Claw and... We of course can teach it to either Jawline or Ore. Um, in all honesty, my original plan was to teach this to Ore in place of Dragon Breath. But Ore's special attack stat isn't like super amazing. And the idea was kind of like, oh, well, maybe I can knock out more stuff with the extra base power of. Dragon Claw, because Dragon Claw is base 80 and Dragon Breath is base 65. But it loses its ability to paralyze. And I'm really not sure if I want to do that anymore. I'm not entirely sure. But I think I'm going to just stick to it. I think we're going to do it anyway. Bye, Dragon Breath. And it's over. No going back now. All right. Save, yes. Yeah, we like to enter again. In it for round five. The only Coliseum, I guess maybe besides Pyrite technically that has five rounds. But Pyrite isn't really a round five, it's more of like a round zero. Five rounds total, though. Come on, bring it on. Oh, you know what? I never mentioned last time. This is going to bug me now. But that main Ectric replaces his his uh, Shadow Raikou. Ainz, that is. Feels bad, man. I was just so absorbed in, into why Ore just couldn't use its, his attack and kept getting hit in confusion. Alright, let's uh. Let's destroy you. Let's destroy you. Maybe the extra base attack will. Or the extra base power on your Dragon Claw will actually help do more damage just in general. I don't know what's more valuable, the chance to paralyze or just consistently doing more damage. Hard to say. Ninkata. Ninkata is part ground type, I know that. Uh... Let's use our new move. Let's do it. Nice. It's already proving useful. I'll return when I'm ready for this. You beating me is unthinkable, impossible, and downright unreal. <laughs> Don't let that ego hit you on the way out. Kadabra and a Kecleon? What do I do here? What's the play? Kecleon's gonna type change. I guess I could make it a I could, okay, I could make it an electric type. That's fine with me. Let me crunch you. Oh, beautiful. Almost killed. 
role play levitate oh that was the smartest move you could have done that was literally the smartest move you could have done because i was going to earthquake <laughs> wow that worked out so well for him holy crap that was a crit all right we're still going to earthquake but man we're not going to kill both of them anymore it's sad Can't believe it. Roll play. Cedra, okay. And we'll crunch again, and then we'll be done. Right? Wait. No. You have four Pokemon. Mistrevis, okay. Um, I guess we'll just we'll just do that. Don't do overthink it. My losing is illogical. It's incomprehensible. <laughs> hmm, what have we here? You're quite the interesting battler to have come along. Bronze. Relicanth and a Murkrow. Oh, both weak to electric. Beautiful. Well, Relicanth, unfortunately. This is going to have to wait, I think. Maybe. Hmm. Actually, who do I want to attack? I could protect, protect an earthquake, see what earthquake does on this, uh, this rail can. Alright, sure. I'm feeling wild today. While, okay. Oh, you actually hit Ore with that? Alright, let's kill you, and then... We're not gonna be able to kill you just yet. You got speed. Hmm. What's a mobile gonna do? Ooh. <laughs> That's what the mobile is gonna do. Check the earthquake, and that should finish it, even with the, the intimidate attack nerf. Yep. 
Yeah. Hyper beam. No, not gonna learn hyper beam. The wind up part of the hyper beam is just so bad. No, no, wait, hold on. I did this last time. <laughs> yes, stop playing hyper beam. There we go. I'm shocked that I lost. Look who it is. KKKKK, you're challenging me? You don't know what you're in for. Deep King Agnol. What a name. Level 68 Giraffe Rig and a level 70 Kingdra. It's, um. Quite the duo of Pokemon he's got here. I think to, to start off with, we're gonna go all in on this Kingdra. Dragon Claw, Thunderbolt. And hopefully not die to the ice cream. Oh, or we can. Uh, I didn't need Ore. It's fine. Ooh, uh, ooh, what do we actually want to do? I'm going to bring out Yoru to handle this giraffe rig, I guess. There we go. King Kingdra's down. Kingdra is probably the scariest thing on this guy's team. It's also the highest level thing on his team. Skarmory. That's what I wanted to see. Oh, light screen. That's not fun. You have a light screen, huh? Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna thunder you, and then... Fuse ray you, and then we'll faint attack. Marvelous. Okay. The rest of his team, who cares about the rest of his team, honestly? Yeah, Sableye, which, you know, whatever. I'm gonna I'm gonna thunder wave this sable I just want it disabled. <laughs> Yoru is only level sixty three. <laughs> we haven't used him like at all. Oh my god, they did a lot. Interesting that this uh, this Pokemon has returned. Very interesting. Really, you're gonna full restore on me, huh? You're gonna full restore on both of them. Still love stabilized animations. So much fun. I'm just gonna faint attack, screw it. Really? How many full resources do you have, dude? I would, uh. appreciate not dying. Okay. There's the light screen. 
And here is your death. Finally out full restores. And he also has a Shedinja. Very easy to take out. And there's the Shuckle. Rui, where'd you come from? We left you behind when we entered the Coliseum. It's kind of funny, if there's ever a Shadow Pokemon, like if you're fighting any of the admins that Shadow Pokemon show up, or if this Shadow Pokemon shows up, she'll just like randomly appear to identify it. Um, Alright, I'm gonna Thunder Wave you before I die. I think this is the, that's the play here, and then we'll faint attack you to kill you. And so Shadow Shuckle here. Shadow Shuckle has the moves. Oh, eyes. Okay, here we go. Has the moves Safeguard, Encore, Rest, and Bide. And shockingly, <laughs> this Shuckle has a catch rate of 190. It's like stupidly high for pretty much no reason as far as I can tell. Um, honestly, I'm going to throw a great ball at it. We're just going to do it. Let's see if we can use up our great balls, and then I'm going to faint attack you, because faint attack's not going to kill you. There's no way. Shuckle has some of the weirdest stats of all time. It's all in on defense. Okay, well, well, we'll, ne we'll never see anything. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, so Shuckle has base 230 defense and special defense. I see. You are skilled. And then Shuckle also has base 10 attack and special attack, base 5 speed, and base 20 HP. So its stats are abysmal except for those two defense stats, which are just sky high. 9,000, that's it. Also, the Deep King was not very... Uh, he was so over <laughs> Oh well, it is what it is. Um, with, uh, with all that said and done, we do have time left. Let's, uh... Let's do a savey, a savey save. And let's get on the road. Let's get out of here. There's no reason to be down here anymore unless you actually just want to compete in Deep Coliseum for something. Like gaining money or experience or whatever. Guys, I caught the thing. So what do you say, Wes? My information is useful, isn't it? Your information's alright, I guess. I'm kind of curious how you come across that information, but... Wes, you've done it! What, what have I done? Oh, defeat the, the Deep King? What's your name? Meg. Okay. No. <laughs> I kind of feel bad now. Uh, let's, um, in all honesty, let's just get out of here. Let's uh, move to a different map area, shall we? F-Disc. Boom. You're right in the, you were like perfectly in the way. Out we go.
Let's, um... We haven't been to Agate Village in a while. Why not? There's really never any reason to come over here. Yes? What's with you? I'm Dash from Finac. I'm just an ordinary citizen who happens to run around the town's fountain. So what gives you the right to have your Pokemon attack me? You don't deserve any respect as a trainer. Shame on you. Uh, uh... Hold the phone. What? I wasn't even anywhere close to Phoenix City. List completed. Hi, it's Nat. I analyzed the Shadow Pokemon list some more and discovered the very last one. The last Shadow Pokemon was Togetic. That completes the analysis of the data ROM you provided. Togetic, huh? Very interesting. Very interesting. Alright, Dash, is that you? That's you, right? Yes, it was me that sent you that email. Why did you attack me? Are you doing this somewhere? Are you doing this elsewhere too? No. I won't believe anything you have to say. I'm kinda curious, what happens if I say yes? I've got nothing to say to you! <laughs> okay, fair enough. Um, do you see anything? Oh hi, it's you two. I'm so glad to see you're safe. I was so worried about you. You have nothing to say. That's weird, honestly. Let's, um... Oh my god. Can I go five steps without getting an email? Who is this? It's bit in the under. Wes, I caught you on film in an unbelievable scene that's terrible and shocking. What's your problem? Why are you attacking people with a shadow tokotic? Oh my god. That is pretty terrible and pretty shocking. I will I will admit that. Um I wanted to go over here and save. <laughs> that's what I wanted to do. What the I, I need some like context as to what's going on here. Who's runner who's impersonating me? Oh, I did not want to go into the box. Alright, let's uh, let's go figure this out. I wonder if we, if we uh, keep coming in and out of the city if we'll keep getting emails. I'm pretty I'm pretty down to do that. No, no more, no more emails. Okay. What if we go somewhere else, like back to the under, for example? Nothing. Okay. Well, let's go back to outskirts stand. Watch TV. It's me, Net. Watch, please watch TV now. <laughs> All right. I guess. Let's go ahead and go inside and watch the TV. There have been reports of another Pokemon attack on people. Here is shocking footage of the harrowing attack sent by one of our viewers. This footage was sent in a in a in by a brat in the under who declined to reveal his identity. <laughs> oh my, you've even visited Pyrite Town with this awful notoriety notoriety? Compared to that place, Phoenix City is a hundred times more beautiful. True. I watched you from here. My, aren't you and your Pokemon strong? Watching you bedazzled me. Why, if I were ten years younger, I'd grab hold and wouldn't leave your side. Recently, there's been nothing but bad news. Wish there'd be a good piece of news that would brighten up the day for everyone. No one has anything to say about the uh, about the news. Wow. Um. 
Oh boy, do I want to move around anyone on my team? Look how low level <laughs> Yoru is compared to literally everyone else. <laughs> Poor Yoru, dude. Man, I kind of feel bad. Um, uh, we'll just we'll just keep it. We're just gonna rock and roll. Okay, well, that's weird. Um, where should we even go? Maybe back to Finnak? No? I kind of just want another email. There it is. Live TV news! Again? Guess we'll watch it again. What? This is the shocking footage of a Pokemon attack on people. Viewer discretion is advised. We bring you this story from the outskirts stand. This is an exclusive scoop with a video feed. Uh, what is going on out here in the five seconds I was gone? This is a rookie reporter. A Ancha? A Ancha? Live on the scene, a shocking new development has emerged. Just when the battle ended, another man appeared, or another shady man appeared, and he looks exactly the same as the other man. What's going to happen here? I, Ancha, will remain on the scene to bring you this breaking story. Okay, listen, listen here. What was going on? Oh, hey, it's you. You creamed me again, it seems. Wait a stinking second. Why are there two of you? Uh, huh. Who the hell are you? <laughs> you re the resemblance is uncanny, hey? Eh? You are me and I am you, and we are all together here. I can see that you don't understand, but there is one thing certain. You're going to battle me. Shady guy, Wes. It's like looking in a mirror. I would never use a Gyarados in the main electric, though. Come on, man. Really? Intimidate. Perfectly fine with me. Um, we're gonna switch out Jawline for Ore then. We're gonna try this strat again. And then you, I'm gonna protect with, because that main neck trick is going to um, have Lightning Rod, and I bet you the, uh, the Gyarados is Earthquake. Don't want to get Earthquaked. Hydro Pump, huh? Okay. I mean, that works also. Now let's, um... Let's buy myself a turn by... Ooh, what do I actually want to do here? Oh, I don't know. This is a tough decision, actually. So I could try for the double protect, have a 50% chance of failing. Or I cannot. I think I'm not going to do that. I think I'm gonna... I'm gonna attack this main act trick, and then you are gonna... I'm gonna double protect anyway. Okay, so it failed. That's kind of why I expected it to happen. And then we'll see what happens here. Ow. God damn, that did a lot. 
Jesus Christ. Roar? You can't do that. That's illegal. Okay. Sure. Uh, we're just gonna do that then. Get rid of this magnetic trick. Milotic is sent out. Um, of course, now my electric type's gone. Let's, uh, what do we actually want to do here? I'm gonna attack this Milotic and then I'm gonna put up a light screen. Because it's going to Ice Beam me. Alright, you can see this coming. God damn. God damn. That's a lot. There it is. Ooh, that... Took me out pretty good. That's okay though. Um, now I can bring Mikoto back out safely, and then we can uh, get rid of this Gyarados and I can get rid of this. Uh, ooh, I cannot get rid of this Milotic. Bye bye Gyarados. What else we got? Hound Doom. Okay. Okay. Go bam, and then we're gonna go. We're gonna go bam. <laughs> I'm protected. Get me away from that. No, thank you. Nice. Alright. That's three Pokemon down? Half your team? Well, whoever's getting live news coverage of this is probably having a blast. There's the Togetic. Alright. Shadow Togetic has the moves Metronome, Charm, Sweet Kiss, and Yawn. This is the last Shadow Pokemon. This is it. I was gonna do uh, do one of these or something. What I actually want to do here. It's only level twenty. <laughs> it's so it's so bad. Um. I'm gonna thunder you, and then I'll put up a reflect, I guess, before I die. A little level 20 Shadow Togetic. I don't know why everyone was afraid of a, a level 20 Togetic, but... Alright, bye, hero. You tried your best. Let's bring in... I'm gonna bring in Impa. Sweet kiss. Everyone's afraid of 
an Impa with, or an Impa, a, uh, <laughs> a Togekiss with Sweet Kiss. I guess the confusion is scary. This is true, this is true. Uh, let's get rid of this Hound Doom. I think this is the play. And then we will brick break wherever the hell comes out after that. Armaldo, that's not gonna die to the brick break if we even hit it. Okay, well. Shadow Rush. Well, let's see it. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, my light screen. At least my reflect is still up. I'm gonna thunder you. No. I'm gonna thunderbolt you. No. Yes. I'm gonna call you. No, I'm gonna throw a ball. This uh, this Shadow Togetic does have a catch rate of 45, which isn't a lot, but it is only level 20. And then also, I just didn't want to like accidentally kill the the Armaldo and then hit this thing, because that would be very unfortunate and kind of suck a lot. No way. Oh, okay, good. I did a lot. God damn. EQ. Oh. Good thing that's a flying type. Very good thing it's a flying type. Oh, thank God. Right, let's do this again. I'm going to be kind of sad if I don't get the chance to paralyze it, but I'd rather take out the... I'd rather take out the raw ball though. And maybe this just catches so we don't have to worry about it. That'd be nice. Nope. Couldn't be that lucky. Alright, take it out. Yeah! Alright, no more worrying. Very spooky. It's kind of cute how little damage it does. Yeah, let's Thunder Wave, throw another ball. We're just on throwing balls city, because that's all we could do. Nothing? Not even a little bit. I don't know how that first ball got so far. Um. I have no clue what the hell I want to do here. Just keep throwing balls and letting letting it uh, shadow rush me to death, so it can will itself down. Sounds like as good as plan as any. We're gonna be here forever. I think I have 50 more or less Ultra Balls. And even greater than that after. <laughs> so if we run out of Ultra Balls, the Tarn Balls will be better than Ultra Balls. And then 
Even got some great balls in there because great balls seem to always work better for whatever reason. I think the play is to wait until um wait until its health is as low as possible to, to use the uh the great balls though. Bonk and then just call. We'll get you one of these days, it'll happen. There we go. It would take me to do it. Good going. I'm you, but better. <laughs> My name is Fane. I'm the master of disguise. How do you like the job I did? Your reputation's totally trashed. <laughs> Really? Did that heal my Pokemon? It did not. <laughs> oh my gosh, the perpetrator of the attacks wasn't the trainer, but an imposter. This is a major scoop. It's a huge break in the story. Wow, what do you got to say? Got a hand to you, guy. It's tough to beat the real thing. Yes, it is. Um, Let's get the hell out of here. I need to heal. We're going straight to Mount Battle to heal. Um, so that is all of the like I said, that's all of the Shadow Pokemon. Literally every last one of them. Um I think I'm gonna I think we're gonna we're gonna switch around a party. Let's uh, grab you and I don't know you. Sure. And I did heal, right? <laughs> yes, yes, we did. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and look at our box, actually. So. This is all the Shadow Pokemon, every last one of them. And at this point, we are kind of at the point where we need to actually, uh, what's the actual word? Purify all of them, purify all of them. So we've got our work cut out for us. It's, uh, it's going to be a, it's going to be a time. I will be doing this off screen. I don't really, uh, there's like no point in filming any of it because it's all going to be doing the same little tricks um, over and over and over and over and over again just for each of the Pokemon. Very tedious, very boring. There is something I do want to show though, because after um, after that happens and you catch every last Shadow Pokemon. Hey, it's you. I was hoping to see you again. You see, I was itching for another battle with you. It was driving me wonky. All right, let's battle. I'm not losing this time. That's right. You can have one last battle with uh, Rider Willie. And he even got himself a Dodrio. He dropped his uh, second Zigzagoon. Which is pretty neat. It's a... Um... I'm gonna confuse Ray the Dodrio, I think, and then... Dragonclaw this Lanoon. Ooh, that did a lot. That was juicy. Um, but yeah, so the, the plan's gonna be, I'm gonna pu purify, quote-unquote, 
I'll, I'll show the purifications, but I'm going to lower the heart gauges. I'm going to make them all ready to purify, and then we'll just have like a, a purify montage, essentially, uh, for most of the next video. And um, we'll take care of any loose ends. I don't even know if there are any, but if there are, we'll take care of them. And then... Uh, besides that, I think, I think, uh, we're just about, oh, we're, we're almost done. We're not quite done yet, which is, I know, surprising. Like, what, what is there even left to do? Um, you'll see. <laughs> it's a doozy, the thing that's left to do. It's a do it's a real doozy. And then, um. Other than that, we're gonna Gen 3 because it's so interconnected, it's gonna be a weird time to try and parse through. So I'll talk more in detail about it when uh when we finally get there. I think this battle's basically over though. Yeah, this battle's definitely over. Sorry, Ryder Willy. Still no match for me after all this time. I think uh it's kind of ironic that I ended up choosing these two Pokemon because it's like the first and last Pokemon that I had to my team. Alpha and Omega. So you can like see the growth in a sense. Knocked out yet again. But yeah, you really are seriously tough. I can't keep up. I don't know how you got your Pokemon a little 50, but a good job, dude. So, yeah, like I said, that that's it. We're done with catching Shadow Pokemon. We just need to purify. I'll lower all those heart gauges off the screen. And that's it for this episode. So, um, actually, before, before I go, since I'm going to be doing all this off screen, let's, uh, I want to show off a, a little trick here. So, if you walk straight down against this spot, you can see how like West like shakes back and forth. This is a way for you to lower the heart gauge of Shadow Pokemon through walking, because that that's a thing, and you can just do that, and it will count as steps. So, if you have some some method of keeping the down input on your controller held with like a rubber band or a quarter or something then you can just leave this here and come back later and see how what kind of progress you made on your pokemon and of course some are going to be more uh more annoying than others because it's all based on natures what actually lowers the gauge faster or slower so some of them are going to be very slow if you try to do it that way some are going to be decently fast and then each Pokemon has its own like heart gauge or shadow gauge amount that gets annoyingly uh, annoyingly high for some Pokemon. And so uh, we do have those three time flutes that we uh, that we picked up from various places around the world. Um, I think they're in here, right? Yeah, there we go. Here's our three time flutes. We're gonna withdraw these. I also think I'm gonna withdraw these rare candies. Yeah. Perfect. Um First things first, let's actually just use the rare candies, I guess. I'm gonna heal first, and then we'll use the rare candies, but um the I think I'm just gonna even level my team. I think that's gonna be the goal here. Get everyone at like level 66 or something like that. Okay, where are the rare candies? Oh, there we have six of them. We have exactly six of them. So we can do three to get you to 66. We can do four, five. It was kind of messy. We're so so far away in levels that someone's always going to be behind. 
But the question is, who do I want to be behind? So, like, I can get you two to 67. I can get you to 67. Actually, I could, I could get everyone except for you to 67. Like, two, four, six. <laughs> and then you're just, like, SOL. Hmm. Or I could do four, five, six, and leave you guys at 65. That seems a little bit more am am amicable. That's not... Is that a word? I don't fucking know. Uh... Oh god, what do I even do here? Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna bring you to 65. And then... I've got four left. So I can do like two and two, or two and two, or something, another. Or I can do three and bring everyone to 66, and then bring someone else to 67. Like jawline. Okay. We're gonna do that. It's happening. Everyone at 66. And then we'll bring Jawline up to Mikoto's level. I like it. Boom. Alright, now let's, uh, let's talk about these time flutes. So... These time flutes I recommend using on... I recommend using one on this Tyranitar. I recommend using one in the Metagross, because both of these Pokemon have the highest uh, shadow gauges of any of the shadow Pokemon, including the ones down here. Um, so use them use them in that order. If you if you only picked up one, or if you only picked up two, then use them on these, these two in that order. So use it on this one first, and then this one if you have another one. And if you picked up the third one, uh, you can choose between any of the legendary beasts. Raikou, Suicune, Entei, any of those three, or you can use it on um, this Skarmory here. Because all three of these, or all four of these Pokemon, have the exact same third highest heart gauge. Or shadow gauge, I don't actually know what it's, what it's called officially, but whatever. Um, either way, uh, use, a, use that third one on one of those four. I'm probably going to use mine on Skarmory personally. But we'll we'll cover all that in the next episode. So that's that's my my spiel, my spiel, my spiel. Um, so yeah, we're gonna we're gonna end the episode here. Like I said, we'll come back and show all the purifications. It'll be a grand old time. So with that, do the YouTube stuff, like the video, subscribe, dislike the video even if you disliked it, and otherwise, I'll see everyone next time.